What's going on? Tectonic Edge here playing some more Mono Green Tron, so let's jump in. A couple of minor changes, mainly to the sideboard. Went ahead and am going to try running some Weather the Storm, see if that has any impact on the game. This is a pretty decent hand here. I uh, wish I had a green source, but uh, definitely a keeper. All right, looks like a Jun build. Simple start and expedition map. Storm count one, all right. Ren and six. Oh, cut the oh, it's not a gen build. This is a dredge build. All right. I see the cycle lands, and I just I think Jun because of running six. Let me see. Well, I could crack that, but with nothing to really play into it. Let me see, what's the graveyard looking like? Two cathartic reunions. Ghost quarter, conflagrate. Yeah, I think we wait on this. All right, then. Relic of Progenitus for the win. Definitely pulled out most of my graveyard hate. Uh, that's all right. This deck is definitely, I think, a little on the underpowered side right now. Let's grab the warping wheels. The storm effects really not going to do anything here. Do I run Shriek Horn? Uh, yeah, maybe a few natures claim in this. Pull out the Ghost Quarter. Couple of the Thrag Tusk. Stone. Yeah, one coil still pretty good. And Hugan's probably our best card. One walking blister. Sideboard cards. Um, hmm. I think we keep this purely because of the relic. Start off with the Tron Land into a Chromatic Star. Keep an 
an eye on his graveyard. Cathartic reunion. Decent. Let's see, what do we have in here? An Assassin's Trophy, Prized Amalgam. Yep. Well, let me see here. I think we're going to try and Warping Whale his next play. Assassin's Trophy? I probably did that in the wrong order, but this is still going to be painful for him. Um. Yeah, sure. I don't really need the filtering, and I still draw a card. stirrings. Grabbing a power plant. Played the Gargari Thug. Power Plant. Expedition Map. Chromatic Sphere. Yep. There's the shenanigans. I don't want any chance of that getting put in the graveyard for the moment. Ugin the Spirit Dragon seems good here. The matchup is definitely slowed down from where it used to be. Alright, just gonna go ahead and scoop it up. Yep. So, yeah, unfortunately, I'm at. 
at least the Tron matchup, I mean, this used to be a hard matchup. Now, I granted, I hit, got pretty lucky with my uh, hitting the Relic of Progenitus's, but this matchup does not feel like the uh, oppressive matchup it used to be. Case in point, I'm no longer sideboarding uh, heavily against it, or at least you know, I don't have graveyard hate specifically in my graveyard now. Granted, that was more for Hogak, but it still this deck was still powerful. Um, during the details, so yeah, uh, thank you for watching. This is Tectonic Edge signing out.